All right, I was told to record when I came on today, and I can see why. Spike has got us some uh, Wither Skulls. Cool. I think we're going to uh, head to spawn. I think there's another surprise waiting for us there. Okay, BTC has joined the sub server, and he's taking a look around. I don't want to get in his face. That's rather rude. But uh, we do have a uh, oh, hype here. Oh, oh, oh. That's not fair, pure. It's kind of funny. I'm watching from across the ravine, and as BTC walks, he's got like an entourage of people just following him. It's hilarious. Oh, okay. I see how it is. I'll use my diamond sword. No! Kill me, and I totally deserve it. I didn't see that coming. See the red? That's blue. She's a, an admin. And pure, uh, he's a moderator. His name's in blue. And they're making sure that I don't do anything funny to BTC down there. They keep punching me. Hi. Hi. Don't you walk by me. Don't you walk by me, Booker. Oh, is this a challenge along the bridge here? <laughs> uh, yeah, but no armor and no weapons. <laughs> no armor and no weapons. Well, I'm already half naked. Well, get full naked, bruh. Full pants. naked, bruh. Fist the cuffs at dawn, bruh. Alright, are you ready for this? Here we are, on the search for one of the most extraordinary creatures in the world of Minecraft. It is the elusive BTC. 300,000 million years ago it has evolved. And there it is. We must be careful not to frighten it. It is heard that a full-grown male could weigh several tons. The BTC has a fashion gimmick of the Punisher look. He is... The BTC has his own harem and is estimated that one has hundreds of females and his sole object in life is that he and he alone mates with every one of them and for that he must fight. No predator would think to attack it but the survival must go on. Ooh, this path goes to the nether hub. There's a nether hub? Yes, there's a nether Do you not play this game? I didn't know we had a set nether hub. Yeah, one of the... Uh, the... It was in the process of... Oh, it looks really nice. Uh, quartz and nether rack and stone, lava. Uh, one of the users, I uh, watched him in chat talk about uh, how... He was mad that nobody built a nether hub, so he took the project on himself and went to town. And it, I'm impressed. I like it. If I ever uh, decide to let people come to my place, I'll probably build a, uh, a connecting uh, path. I found the portal. Whoops, and I walked through and a creeper blew up. My bad. No, it doesn't. Okay, I'm borrowing a flint and steel. Ooh! 
some of my best. All right, there's a lot of activity going on around here, and it's mostly building. Uh, very few shenanigans this week, but I was kind of impressed that I actually got to see BTC building on the server. So, all right, uh, the uh, storage room is getting full. Lots of cobble, lots of dirt, because we are just digging like crazy. All right, we can finally, finally got a quarry going here. And it hasn't gotten very deep, but it's going to have four uh, mine cart elevators. We're going to have this in the center. Uh, it's kind of a little trap, too, because as the pigmen come out, they've been falling. So that cuts down on the number of pigmen we get uh, running around here. Now, over here, we've made this our slaughterhouse. We used to have the cows out here. We've kind of pulled them inside. All right, simple little slaughterhouse. You feed them up top, the babies go down, they grow up, and we just kick them with a little lava. Bam. And then we've got beef for days. And we'll probably do a, a pig one over here, and we'll do the uh, automatic chicken cooker over here. So this whole room is just going to be... Uh, you know what? I don't like that. There we go. A little subdued uh, texturing there. That's the way we do it. All right, on around here, as you can see, we uh, got rid of the uh, temporary uh, mine shaft staircase because we now have an official one. All right, still got the uh, enchanting room. It's looking pretty good. It's growing. I'd like to get some more bookcases going. Uh, this annex is built, a uh, room for rent. If anybody's willing to pay uh, a stack of diamonds a month. Over here is where you may have seen earlier we decided to build our skeleton grinder. This this room was here first and I was planning on building a path through the jungle. Oh, lock myself out. But over here because there was already a skeleton uh, spawner in the mountain which I dug out the mountain we just went ahead and modified it a little bit to uh, to come in here. So it's just basically a water system. It pushes all of them forward. They come up a little water stream in the back, get pushed forward, and drop right here. And then once again, we just hit them with the, uh, the lava, get us a uh, splash potion of health, and then... Uh, once they die, we hit them with the splash potion. Or, excuse me, not when they die, but after the fire takes them down to half heart. All their drops go down into this chest. And then we just kind of manually organize and sort. I do believe Spike has plans to automate all of that. But I'm not sure. I, I, I'm going to leave that up to him. He's, he's the building guru. He's the building genius. So however he wants to do that. All right, this room over here, uh, Max, who goes by iTrek on his channel, has decided to claim this as his little home away from home, and he's gonna decorate it however he wants. Right now, I've left him a little gift of bunk beds, so that uh, you know, if he wants to uh, sleep in the bunk bed, that's where he can sleep. All right, and of course he'll decorate. He's already started a little bit of uh, a walkway there. All right, over here, uh, room for rent. Got nothing there. And room for rent there, nothing there. All right, let's go take a little bird's eye view like we uh, normally do here. We'll do the old time lapse thing. Woo! I have to be very careful. I'm not wearing my feather fall boots. Uh, believe it or not, the feather falling boots has saved me once. Uh, I just missed the portal and landed right over there. All right, this is what it's looking like. My creeper hole. Uh, Blue Hush, one of the system administrators, came out to uh, my jungle because I have the only jungle on the map. 
to get some kitty cats and they spawn right around in here she was out there catching the cats at night and a creeper blew up but that's okay i can fix it uh digging out the mountain a couple of farms going there and there got the uh watermelon and pumpkin going i think i'm going to modify the reed farm uh, i'm going to work on that mountain right there uh, probably all the way down to the river that way it's from coast to coast we just have like farmland and then this mountain i'm going to smooth out and make it uh, kind of uh, a gradual hillside and not so much a uh, cliffs of dover look somebody has been planting flowers i didn't even know they did that sometimes it's good to step back and take a look at your work get a better perspective all right, that's our quarry. I'm pushing toward maybe cutting the corners off since everything is round. Uh, I'll still keep the quarry square, but as far as there, I'll cut the corners off. All right. Well, that's about it for today, for this week. Hopefully you in, uh, enjoyed everything that's been going on. Salute. Uh, stop by the BTC sub server. Uh, be more than happy to show you around. I uh, might even put you to work digging out a mountain. I've done it before. All right, leave a like. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel. Welcome. Share this with your friends. And as always, I will see you next time.